Hello everyone, it is me, it is I, it is the Look What Came Yesterday. And we are going to do an unboxing of this mammoth beast. Yes, we are. Right, so I need to find various items. This one will do. To get the cellophane off. Can. It's so big. It's another big one, but this is for my grandson, my youngest grandson for Christmas. So I've got to crack on and do it. So this is going to have to be kitted up. And the thing is, though, I was hoping that my Timu um, bottles would arrive um, yesterday or today so I could um, kit it up into those. But it hasn't. They haven't arrived so um, they're expecting it at every, but yeah. So I think I'm going to have to do this kitting up into one of my Elizabeth Ward knockoffs. Right, so let us see. Open this up. This is... Ooh, this is... Oh my God, look at it. One of these big boxes. And that, that, oh my word, I have a card, I have a card, and it is that one. I think that's another bronze one, isn't it? No, it's a silver one. Yeah, it's silver. Right, let's get my, my thing me jig up. Yeah, because that's a bronze one. And this one is a silver. I'm going to have to get a little box just to put these cards in. I thought I ordered one for like the playing cards, you know, that you can get on. So I can just put them in. I haven't done them. Yep. Yes, I think that's what I'm going to do. Right. So let us see. Oh, my God. My See, these boxes would be ideal, except it's too flipping long. I mean, because look, you put them all in there, lovely, but way too big. I mean, where would you store that? If they did one about that size or make it so that it could, you know, slide in, that would be ideal. But well, right. So here we go. Let us see this. We have a picket pen. Perfect. Another one already preloaded, which is great. And I do like their trays. Yeah, much better than the cheapy old ones I used to have. Right, so same about the hole, because I can't use that. But in here, look, you get the wax. Oh, you get spare lid nib. Never had one of those spare before. And a bigger placer. So I'll take that one out and I'll put that one in. If I can. There we go. Click, click. That's in there. Right. So these I will put in one of these and deal with it later. One of those can go in there. That can go in the drawer. I tightened up my... I did very well today, actually. I've tightened up my um, drawer unit, except for one screw, which is right down the bottom end of the back and I couldn't get to it, but I did that. I tightened up the arms of my chair, except this one, obviously I didn't do the lower one. So I've got still got one more arm to do with that one. I've put a load of washing up on and I've got a load of washing up in the washing up bowl soaking. Um, and I've made an effort of, um, emptying out one of my drawers from my drawer unit. So I've got three drawers and I found some stuff. So what I'm going to have to do is, which I can't quite get rid of, I'm going to have to empty the, the bottom drawer because that one hardly ever works. It's sort of a bit stiff and put all the stuff in there that I need to keep, but I've got nowhere for it to go. 
and then at least I'll be left with two drawers for one for my you know things like I can put in my coasters to be done you know and um and the key rings to be done and the wooden templates and all that stuff which at the moment I've got in a little box under the table all things that I can um you know bling up so they can go in the second drawer and in the top drawer well I suppose in the top drawer I could put that in and in the second drawer down I could put my sewing bits and my fabric bits I think that's what I'm going to do yep oh and have a look at this I found this in the drawer did this a little while back it's going polystyrene ball and then you get lots of little squares of fabric and you you know about one inch or whatever size and then you um fold them over and fold them over again so you've got these creases and then what you do is inside you will put these little pins see i've got the little pins there to hold them in but you'd have them in the middle there and and to hold them together and so you can't really see them on these bits but yeah i did that in a class um when i had my fabric shop we did christmas decorations you know they remind me of the old pomanders that you used to get you know where you'd have the orange and the clothes would be stuck in it um and then with a bit of ribbon and hang it up but yeah so you could do quite a few of those but yeah didn't take it yeah i suppose the the prepping took me forever because i was having to cut out all these lots of little squares actually i've still got a bag load of squares upstairs maybe if i hunt out one of the polystyrene balls if i've still got any I might be a bit dented i can um do a demo and show you but anyway that is digressing because we are doing this so there is another one of those they're quite good because they can stack which yes All right now let's see this that bit and then how many colors is this one there it is 61 oh it would be 61 one of those cases is 60 but so if i'm going to do it in i can do it in one of these i think i'm gonna have to because this is all i've got left at the minute and no, i don't like doing them in these but well yes so that'll be the next kitty up so i'm going to keep that out because i have to as I say crack on and um and do it for um for my grandson right well, that can be bye bye right so now we've done that let us open the painting up itself my god it's a big one i've got to get a frame for it as well oh. Oh my God, look at all that pile, jeepers. But I like the fact that it's in, um, oh, it's beautiful, look at this. It is in, um, got a massive border, look at that, all that colour blocking and all that colour blocking, oh my God. But you've got like, number one, it's like a mini diamond painting, you know. Number four, a mini diamond, they're all mini like mini diamond paintings. So I like that. So yes, so I'm going to be um, cranking that up. I have to, I'll do the whole border, I think, first. But yeah, so we've got 61 colours and we have, oh my word, oh yeah, because they put the ABs at the bottom now. Two ABs and one, two, three, four Zs, four fairy dust, pixie dust, something like that. I love the canvas so sparkly it is beautiful and we've got the tear lines on here but we haven't got the marked they're not the marked ones because some of them have been marked to um 
so you can see where they are. That looks like it's stuck. I don't know, is that stuck? I'm not sure, that bit's all stuck along there. Yeah, I'll have to see that. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, let's move you along. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like it's... um. Oh, hold on a minute. Is that a second piece? No, it's not a second piece of... It just looks like it's stuck to it. You know, like heat sealed to it. But well, yes. Oh, I can't wait to do that. So that is that. Oh my word. Oh yes. And it sort of just fits on here. Right. So there's that. Let us have a look at these because I will be needing to get these out. So I'll get them out now ready to um to kit. Oh my word. Look at this. Right. Right, what? Oh my God. Two, three, four, five. That's for the border and anything that's in between. Right, I'm going to snip these ready so then I can just. So that's 807. <clears throat> One massive bag of that. 517, another big bag. Five, 200. Oh, six, six, six. Three, eight, four, four. Three, three, four. Oh, nine, two, one. First of the Zeds, and that is, it's a pixie dust, fairy dust one. Two bags of 322. Hmm. 823. This one, I much prefer the little pots because you can just put them in and you know that they're going to take X amount. There's these, you have to pick your bag that you want to choose. Your pot. Four, six, nine. Two lots of those and two lots of three, seven, seven, six. Eight, two, four. Four, seven, one. Two of five, twenty. Oh. An AB. Five two hundred. Two of seven four one. Four hundred. Oh. Two of six eleven. No, hold on a minute, eh? Hold on a minute. These are six oh one one. Now I'm confused. I don't have a 6011. It's one of the new ones, isn't it? Oh dear. Two lots of 301. 553. Two lots of 742. And two lots of 402. And well, I've got 402 in the um their bottles in a bag underneath and two lots of three three oh god and here's some z ah this must be the other part of the border oh, look at it all one two three four five seven bags of that seven forty Eight oh three 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 six 
Holy moly is all I can say. I'm definitely going to have to get one of my, um, I think I might need to get a bigger one, one of my pencil cases out for the extras. Nine twenty. A Z. Four four five. Six o thirteen. Hmm. A B. And look at these in comparison. Four one five. These are only going to be one bag, one box. Nine three four nine six seven one fifty three seven three one one five four three eight ten. How are we getting there? Seven sixty eight zero oh, one. Eight one five three two seven Ooh, three three five oh and nine one nine and three eight twenty three. Oh and the last ones which are eight one seven six oh eight and two of oh, five eight one. My god. Well these ones and this one can go in a big one. But well, that, they are all the colours. So you've seen all the colours. Let's have another look, shall we, at this painting. Oh my God, look at it all. Uh -huh. Definitely multi-placing that. I like to automatically, automate the... I'm trying to get those all straight. It's going to be... um. Mm, oh well. Right. And I'm going to have to work out what size frame I'm going to need. I need a poster frame would do it. I'll have to look up the poster sizes. Because, you know, this is sort of it. Cut off the extra. Sixty-nine point nine by ninety point nine. Randall Spangler. Counting with the dragons. Draglings. Mm. Oh, I can't wait. This is bright and cheerful. Yep. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. <laughs> and the lines in between. Mm. Oh, well, this isn't getting it done, isn't it? So on that note, I'm going to love you and leave you. What I might do is I might actually find a case where I can swap it over for these into one of these of some of my other paintings that perhaps I've kitted up and then I can use that. Alternatively, I'd just be brave and just use it because then that's only the added extra work, isn't it? And then when Louise starts, Diamonds in the Desert, starts her um, threadhead one, we call it woolhead one, because um, I'm going to do my woolhead one at the same time. And then by then, I think 
one of my cases or one of my pack of bottles should have turned up by then and I can kit it up yes right so there we have it for now and I will oh go on at an angle I will love you and leave you and um, I will see you very soon in the kitting up so have fun and um, sleep well if you're going to bed and uh, yeah take care everyone all right then love you all bye bye